Hello everybody, my name is Luchara, and this is Grand Casino Tycoon. Brand new game just came out today, so we are going to check it out. It is obviously a tycoon game where you run a casino. So we are going to jump into the first uh, first scenario, first map, whatever you want to call it. We need to collect three trophies, it looks like. So let's see what this is all about. Press any key to continue. Ah, there you are. It's been more than a year. Where have you been all this time? I've been playing other games, man. I have a new job for you. Help me manage my newly built casinos and drain some rich kids of their daddy's money. Take it all and give it to those who really need it. Me. <laughs> okay. Whatever you say, boss. I know you already know this, but let's go through the controls anyway. Move Got the it. camera using WASD or by holding the right mouse button. Rotate it with the middle mouse button. You know the drill. Use the scroll I'm on to it. zoom in on every beautiful, beautiful detail of our casino. Beautiful casino. It's quite a floor. I'm going for the Cubert look, I guess. Well, right now it's rather empty here. It is. Let's change that. Okay. My market research team put together a checklist of objects which our potential guests will want to okay. have. Okay. These are the requirements for a gambler type. We want some gamblers. Low stakes shot slots. <laughs> have a, any regular bar, any bar table, any business buffet, any food table. Have a toilet. Okay. Let's get building. Go on and open the build menu. Okay. Whatever Let's you say. first build the items in the requirements to lure in our first guests. Low stakes slots. Okay. Okay. So the yellow thing around it is the noise, I guess. Because it says it's noisy. Let's put these. So how do I have to rotate? So maybe let's put these over here in the in the corner. Right? So they don't make uh so the noise is limited. So just over here. Sounds like a good idea. So we got our slots. Now we need a regular bar. It looks like everything else is locked out. Table games, profiling, and advertisements. Drinks and bars. So we need a cocktail bar. Let's put this over here. Perfect. Then we need a bar table. That right there. Perfect. Need a business buffet. It's not a business buffet. That is a sandwich. Remove wall, sell, remove object. No. So food table. Okay. Okay. No, this is a business. This is a business buffet. I did not realize it. Let's put that here. Yeah, that should work. And the food table. So put this right there. All right, and then we need a toilet. Floors, room dividers, decorations. Toilets. Do we not need our own room for that? Oh, okay. I see how it works. So there's a stench. So we don't want this to be near anything else. Hmm. I mean, I could put it over here. I guess it's kind of out of the way, but people still need to walk by. Good. We built everything this gambler type expects from a casino. Perfect. Unpause the game now and watch our sheep. Our esteemed guests flock into Just call them casino. sheep, man. It's fine. <laughs> I don't like him. All right, unpause the game. Here Oop. they are. Space bear does pause. I already hear the sweet clinking of money entering our slot machines. Even old Gerard shows. Oh, Gerard, Just perfect. Watch. He's my He'll hero. Straight to the slot machines and then turn to the wine bar. If he even fits between those one-armed bandits. Oh. It's a lot of chirps for old Gerard Each there. Each gambler type has their VIP, like old Gerard here, that act as ambassadors for their like-minded okay. gamblers. Here, you can see how happy that specific gambler type is with each aspect of our casino. Okay. I so they're... The next game will be my great win. Sure, sure, Gerard. So basically, he's just neutral right now. The happier they are in each category, the more gamblers of this type will visit our casino. That makes sense. 
So I did see one big problem right at the start. When they come in, they walk by the toilets to get to the cashier. That was probably a mistake. But, oh well. Alright, so happier, more, makes sense. Yeah, see, they, they try to go straight. The toilet gets in the way. But I don't want to put the toilets over here either. I, I, compl I completely regret my entire layout. <laughs> Go and improve but I mean, the happiness of Gerard and his friends by adding some decoration oh, to the casino. Oh, decoration, okay. Me and Gerard here, we go way back. Unlike me, Lots you know, famous actor after our dealings in Russia. Bad idea. Now, he's one of the slot zombies. They drink wine and only play the noisy slot machines. Okay. It's half Frenchman and half cartoon character. <laughs> He's here first and foremost to have fun. Easy prey. So, he yells when playing or drinking. Loves funky music. Hates soothing music. Hates show offs. And hates partying. All right. Good to know. All right, so we need to build decorations. Eight decorations. Yeah. And I, like I said, I regret everything, but it wouldn't be a first run if I didn't regret everything, right? Decorations. Oh, we got all kinds of options here. They're all... All these are 250 bucks, and these ones are 1000 Does money matter right now? I have 271 k but I am losing money right now. <laughs> Card statue. So they're all just beautiful environment and ambiance, right? Yeah, so I guess it doesn't really matter. So let's put uh, some stuff there. So there, that should help with that area. I'll put some stuff here. So let's go with some different things. A little lamp. And what's this card statue? There, so pretty much no matter where they go on this side, they are in the green ambiance area. Area. So he's going, yeah, going to the bathroom. Oh yeah, let's make our bathroom Excellent. stylish. <laughs> now let's Style add some music to our casino. You wouldn't believe how easy it is to manipulate people with music. Listen, I don't want to manipulate people. I just want people to come in, have fun, and maybe lose a little money along the way. Just make sure to use the correct music. Thankfully, people post all the info we need on social media. <laughs> of course they do. I put it into the trait section of each gambler type. Traits. Okay, so they love funky music. They hate soothing music. Perfect. Study it we knew that already. Build a few music speakers. Soothing music, funky music, club music. They love that funky music. There we go. Oh, they want four. Well, they need funky music when they go to the bathroom. Clearly. Good. <laughs> that works, I, can I guess. Never have too many decorations or speakers. Well, I'm gonna tell you run out of space. Keep in mind, each object has a running cost. Oh no. I hate running costs. I wish they would just walk. The only way to see how our sheep <clears throat> Gamblers <laughs> like the new decorations and music is to wait for their feedback. Time is money. Time is money. So let's speed it up. While we're waiting, I'll grab a quick afternoon scotch. But you'd better keep improving our casino. When okay. Reach... Good. Good. Our casino becomes more and more popular as a gambler's happiness increases. Time Makes to sense. Take it to the next level. Oh, the next level. I like that. I like the sound of that. All right, well, I'm going to take it off this fast speed. <laughs> a larger casino attracts more gamblers. So, let's buy a new lot and expand our casino. Okay. I to like where this is going. Lot, open the build menu and click Ooh. one of the lot signposts, which marks the area directly outside our casino walls. Can we only do this one? I guess. I cannot stop playing. I love it. Oh, Gerard's happy. So twenty thousand up front, thousand rent. 
Yeah, that should be ah, fine. More space. Do you hear that? It must be my um our wallet. Cheer yeah, yeah. With joy. You're greedy. We get Although, it. The increased rent makes it sad. Yeah, terrible. Terribly sad. All right, can I move this? I can't. Put you over in the corner. It'll still make it look cool, though. There. There. Now people don't have to smell it when they come in, right? Well, I see it as an investment in our future. Sure, sure. Because with this much free real estate, we can attract It's not free real estate, type. though. <laughs> it's literally costing us $1,000 per per whatever. Oh, that's fine. So, let's find out what we need to build to okay. lure them in. Oh, wait, wait, hold up. Before we do that... Select the locked gambler type to see... Okay. <sighs> They want objects we currently can't Oh, that's build. no good. I'll take care of it. You better. Time. But first, let's look at their traits. I also love funky music. Hates club music. Hates noisy. Oh, that's not good. So we'll have to move them away from there. Hates yelling. Hates partying. Hates show offs. All right, so we'll have to separate check them. check the traits first before unlocking a new gambler type. Right. That way, we will know how to plan our casino. Of course. As you can see, the posh gambler hates noisy slots and yelling gamblers. There, put a couple extra slot machines in because they were unhappy with the number of uh, machines I had. There wasn't enough for them. See this? They're unhappy. Cannot find a slot machine. Try placing this gambler's favorite type slots or table games to increase your satisfaction. Use cameras to gather ratings for objects. Try fixing negative events affecting the gambler. Well, I did fix it. I can put in more machines. <laughs> so yeah, Posh hates noisy and yelling. Thankfully, I got some new video poker machines. Yes. They don't make any noise. No, they don't. Place them in the new lot. Far away from the noisy oh. slots and our yelling slot zombies. Can I move these? Yes, if I go in that way, I can. Are they going to go to the slot machines? Instead of coming all the way over here, they are. Okay. So do I have enough slot machines now? Put another couple slot machines just to make sure slot zombies are uh, have enough brains to chew on. All right, so they're not unhappy anymore about the uh, about the lack of machines. We appears we're good there, but it looks like our food's all pretty busy. Let's uh, let's get ahead of things here and let's put in more another small table here. that and then wait did I put these back no that's this is right there there just to make sure because all, all our seats were occupied over here and we don't want that all right so we got to build two more video poker machines so let's do that Great. perfect before we continue we should make sure none of our yelling slot zombies uses the video oh. poker machines. How do we do that? I'm sure he's going to let me know. I'm curious. You see, our gamblers are, let's say, stubborn. When they want to play slots, they will go to the closest slot machine. Okay, that makes sense. But if there is no free slot machine close by, they will walk through the whole casino to find one. Okay, and if they happen to see a video poker machine on their way, they're going to hit that, I the guess? The best way to avoid this is to provide them with enough slot machines in their area. Oh, I feel like I already did Let's that. Let's do just that. I feel like I'm a step ahead of you. No, I'm not. <laughs> Fifteen. That is a lot. So let's actually move. 
we got to go into build mode to move stuff. So let's move you there. Build you there. Move you there. You there. Now let's put in some more here. I mean, do I need 15, so I need two more. Well done. There we go. This should make sure the slot zombies stay in their yeah. part of the casino. Stay in your part of the casino, slot zombies. Now, we just need to get the posh gamblers to play at the video poker machines. Right. Let's look at their routine to oh. find a way. Remember, Let's do that. our gamblers are mindless sheep. <laughs> they have a routine and stick to it. All right, if you say so. So they play low stake slots, then they go to the business buffet and eat, then they play low stake slots, then they go to the regular bar bar table, and they go to the bathroom. All right. They always start with the topmost activity and continue down the list. When they reach the end, they start again from the top. All right. Perfect. That kind of, kind of makes sense. Oh, that's slot zombies. Posh gambler's routine is drink at a luxury bar. I don't think I have that. So we will have to get that. Fancy buffet. Do I have that? Low stakes table. Low stakes slots. Okay. Well, looks like they always grab a drink first. So let's do so that. So the best thing would be to place a bar close to the video poker machine. Indeed. Don't forget the bar tables. Luxury bar. This fit right here. Oh, it will. Burp. Good. Build the remaining objects close to the bar, and we can finally greet our new um guest. There we go. That should be enough. I hope. Ideally, you should keep the walking distance short. Right. As less walking means more spending. Oh, of course. That's what we care about. <laughs> so they need a low stakes table. Perhaps table. Put it right here. Low stakes gambling with six seats. Yeah, let's put, put it there, I guess. And we need a fancy buffet. Food buffets. Sandwich. Seafood. That is fancy. Put it here. Excellent. Now, now we, need we just need to make them happy to empty their pockets. Uh, here and maybe like that. Yeah. Keep you them know happy. what to do. Build, Build decorations and music speakers. All right. Okay, Boomer. Oh. It's Austin Powders. Austin Powders. All, all right. Same mission all posh gamblers are on. Getting their party on. Play that funky music. Austin Powders, really. Has it that he's rumor has it he's on a secret mission, so he likes to keep his head clear. Well, why is he gonna drink then? I guess that's why he hates party. All right, so what do we need for them? Bosh camera, funky music. Play that funky music. Gotta make sure the whole area is polluted with funky music. <laughs> there, that covers the whole area, I think. And then we need some decorations. See if we can fill in some gaps here. What else do we got for decorations here? Oh, they like the horse statue, I can tell. I can just tell, I can feel it. And what else do we want? What about this? That looks tacky, though. That's more for... Well, there is a crafts table here, though. Right? Right, like, is this gonna, is this gonna block people's getting around? And eh, one way to find out, I guess. 
But there's a couple of spots that don't have that aren't in the green, but I'm curious if that blocks people. Let's take pause off here. We need to get up to 60 popularity. 60%. So we're at 50 now. How are we doing on the slot zombies? Oh, they're at 58. What do we got to get um, up to 60 on both? Or just the posh ones, I wonder. What are the slot zombies routines? Do I have a regular bar? Over here for them? I don't think I do, do I? This is a buffet. I don't know what I do with a regular bar. Never mind. Yeah, never mind. Alright, so we're over 60% with them. Oh, what's going on here? I guess cannot find an unoccupied activity nearby. So they are a slot zombie. So come over here. There's all kinds of slot. Okay, so I see the problem. He went to the bathroom. Now he's lost. That's a problem. But I don't want to put any more slot machines over here. Right, because they're noisy. We can put a, we can tuck a couple in here. Just, just for you. Yep, there he goes. Alright, so how are they doing here? Oh, we're only at 53%. They're up to 63, so what don't they like? Everything seems to be going well for them. Maybe it's just need... Okay, it's just an overtime thing. It's got to wait for it to slowly build up as they... As they're satisfied. So it looks like they can get at everything. Like, this plant's not blocking anything. People can pass through each other. So where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, you're leaving. <laughs> yet all right so they're getting food gonna sit down and eat you're gonna eat nobody's really playing much craps right oh they don't like the ambiance they hate that there's noisy slot machines nearby well crap all right we're gonna have to move these then So I will have that issue probably though, when uh, when the slot zombies come out of the bathroom, they uh, they might not be able to find a place to go. Right, so I fixed that issue, so that should clean itself up here very soon. I certainly hope anyway. There we go. So I'm, I'm, I expect this will start climbing again. Gastronomy. Gastronomy? Oh, wait. Try building decorations. Do I really not have enough decorations? Apparently not. Well, I guess I do have these little gaps. I should, everything's covered, though, right? Like... Oh, they still don't they're way over here like that's all oh, maybe when they're going to get chips well, I guess we better move this <laughs> we sell it so way to sell stuff sell yes right, so there's lots of slot machines all right, let's see if this starts going to, oh, we're down to 48% popularity. That's not good. So why aren't they more happy with the gastro gastronomy or music, I wonder? So how do I put in cameras? Manipulators. Okay, so we can't put in cameras yet. We got to, we're not far enough in the tutorial for that. All right, so we're, the popularity is climbing again. Yeah, so you really got to keep, like, the slots away from s stuff like the cashier, right? Because when they come in... Oh, what's going on? Oh, oh, we got two people lost. 
Slot zombie. Slot zombie. So uh, having the bathroom way over there is probably not good. All right, so I did it. I got my 60%. Good job, you were natural. You now know everything to complete the remaining casino goals. Oh, do I? Earn at least one trophy, and you'll receive the keys to the next casino. See you over there. I will see you over there in the next episode. That's going to be all for this one. But this game seems pretty interesting. I'm enjoying it. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, leave a comment if you want to see more Grand Casino Tycoon. I think I'll probably make some more videos. I enjoyed it so far. But yeah, interesting little game. Obviously, we're just learning the basics right now. But uh, yeah. I'm looking forward to some more. Let me know if you are too. Be good to each other. Have a great day. And I'll see you in the next one.